would do for some cold water. <gasps> Maybe this will help. <sighs> that wasn't refreshing at all. Maybe I'll have better luck with one of these water bottles that claims to keep your water cold for up to 24 hours. So do they work? And are they really worth the cash? Here are our thirst quenchers. The Hydro Flask costs $29.95 for 18 ounces. We paid four cents more for the Yeti and half that cost $14.95 for the Mira. We used 20 ice cubes and one cup of water. All three bottles started at 35 degrees, pretty chilly. But will they keep their cool in the sun? We put all three water bottles outside at one of the hottest parts of the day. Four hours later, the Yeti and Hydro Flask still had ice. So which bottle gets the title being the coldest, the longest? We created a bar graph for you to make it easy to understand. Coming in at 75 degrees, we've got the Mira. Kind of toasty if you ask me. Things are really cooling down. Next one, Hydro Flask comes in at 60 degrees. Pretty nice with the Yeti. They got you beat by one degree. We're talking 59 degrees, and now you, H2, know which one is the best water bottle. We're gonna put it online for you, abc15.com slash smartchopper. You guys surprised at all? The science is incredible behind that. I oh don't get yeah. it. I've heard Thank great you. things about Yeti, so I kind of expected that they were gonna right? be yeah. at the top The there. reputation holds mm -hmm. strong. So the Hydro Flask was a little bit cheap, cheaper, and the mouth is a little bit smaller, but if okay. you don't care, I mean, you could pay less and be only one degree hotter. So maybe the Hydro Flask might be That'd better be for it. you. <laughs> yeah. Hey, anything that stays cold in the heat, we'll take it, right? Yes. Uh -huh. It's on our website. Check it out. Awesome. Thanks, Chelsea. Uh, we